Yo, mi gente, it's around six and I woke up, did my morning routine, and now I'm up and ready for the battle, the mental battle that is today, every single day. It's like a war zone up here. And we have to prepare ourselves with the right equipment, okay? With the right strategy to carry on with the day with this positive momentum. And you really want to develop the strength needed to not fold throughout the day because there's always gonna be, there's always gonna be that voice within your head that tells you, nah, you can't do that. Are you sure about this? Bro, that's not you, you, you can't make money. Or you can't impact people, you can't influence people, you can't be a leader. You're always gonna have voices like that, but you have to be stronger than that voice and show them you're the one in control. Right now, I'm gonna go um, shower real quick. I'll probably dress up and take a walk and enjoy the beautiful air right now. The beautiful environment right here. People say Norwalk is ghetto. I love Norwalk. Norwalk is my hometown. Norwalk is where I was born, where I was raised. Um, to me, there's nothing ghetto about it. We went on a nice walk. We came back. I ate some breakfast with my family, and now I'm getting ready to receive the word of God. We're walking to church. I'm gonna meet up with my friend, Obi. Uh, we're gonna talk, and I'm not too sure what he's gonna talk about, but let's find out. Yo, I've been doing a terrible job vlogging, bro. I've been missing hella stuff. I just came from US5. I ate, um, I ate twice. I just came back, it's around six. And we got a couple things on our schedule. I have to create my schedule right now, so that's what I'm gonna work on. Got it done real quick, let's go. Jeez, trust the process, man, look at this. Oof. It's gonna be another late night, 10.22. We got one, two, three, four, five things. And we got some small disciplines, but those only take a second. So let's get to it, man. Come on, 11.04. Let's go. We're doing good, we're doing good. We finished the modules, man. Finally. I know what time it is, man. Reading time. Let's go. Veo los rostros de las personas. Me encanta ver las sonrisas brillantes y las expresiones de expectativa, pero siempre hay algunos que se ven oprimidos y desanimados. No sé nada acerca de ellos y no quiero juzgarlos, pero sus caras se ven tristes. Se ven como si hubieran perdido la esperanza y no esperan que pase algo positivo. Y con demasiada frecuencia obtienen exactamente lo que esperan. Yo entiendo a las personas desanimadas. Una vez fui una de ellas. I can't find my Jada roller. I don't know where it's at. But I was able to use something else to uh, massage my face. And right now I'm using uh, some Mario Badesco, something like that, some product clean my face because I ran out of the other product that I was using but look it's not even doing anything I'll be back right now I didn't really get to vlog a lot of my day because I forgot throughout the day to pick up the camera and just you know document the little moments which is not bad because it, it shows that I'm living in the moment for sure but at the same time as like this vlog is probably gonna be way too short to even extract value from it but this is why i'm gonna add value right now okay it doesn't matter what you did before it matters what you do today tomorrow and the day after that man because you can be a winner all your time all your life but if you lose today that's the only memory people are gonna have of you that you're a loser today <laughs> and people trust me they're praying for your downfall, man. Especially when you're strong. Especially when you're a great leader. They want you to fail. <laughs> they want you to be just like them. So, understand, man. You're only as good as your last performance. And that's something I learned in sales. It's not something to be, like, rude. You know, I'm not trying to be, come up as mean. It's just a reality. People, their perception of you only goes so far in their mind because they're so worried about themselves they don't think too much about your past 
when it when it's something good when it's something bad they'll bring up your past all the time but when it's something good they're not gonna count that to judge your character man they're gonna judge the mistakes you made today the mistakes you made in your past what you've done recently that just does uh, upsets them that's what they're gonna focus on so what i would say to you guys is cancel out the outside noise don't even listen to it but always make sure you're giving out giving your best every single day so people don't even have that reason to call you a loser man they're gonna do it eventually this is bound to happen but you don't want to give them an actual reason to justify them saying that you know what i'm saying just work hard on yourself be better than who you were yesterday and that is success in itself this is not a competition you don't have to compare yourself to your neighbor no we're all unique we're all special in our own different ways you have to find your talents and your gifts and use it to your advantage and build something for yourself and your family wow we're on episode 38 on the break it down podcast and i want you guys to go watch it right now because we're giving out gems man let me know what you guys think about this video you know hit the like and subscribe button if you want leave a comment for sure because i want to know how to improve this but me gente there's no better way to spend my time than with a community that cares so thank you so much for being here i'm gonna see y'all tomorrow peace